Hello fellow fragrance lovers. I have another unboxing today on H Loves a Fragrances. This is from Superdrug. So I bought something from Superdrug. So the look. Superdrug always packages their boxes so well. But here we go. Yes, 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 yes. Hello, my big box of Rebel and also some Tresemme Keratin Smooth with Marula Oil Heat Protect Spray. That's for my hair. So we're just going to check it over there. Rebel by Rihanna. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so... <laughs> I bought this one uh, because a perfume YouTuber that I absolutely love, her name is 50 Cents UK. And if you're not following her, you need to go and check out her channel. But she told me that this is a great perfume. So I was like, I'm going to go buy it. So I went and I ordered it straight away from a super drug. So let's open this up. I'll be honest, I didn't realize how big the 100 mil box would be, but here we go. It's got Miss Rihanna on there. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of Rihanna, I have to admit, but her perfumes have been amazing. Oops. Ooh. Look at that. Would you look at that? Okay. I like it. Do you know, I actually quite like this bottle because I feel like it's very sturdy. I can put it down and it's not going to fall. I quite like the bottle design on these Rihanna bottles. Um, yeah, because it's it doesn't... It needs a lot for you to knock it over because it's got such a wide base. I do like that about these uh, bottles. <laughs> this is quite cute. Quite cute. Right. I'm going to try some of this now. I'm really excited about trying this out. The top notes, uh, they gave me a little bit of a giggle because the top notes is big strawberry, ginger and plum. Now, I've been growing strawberries for, I think, over 12 years now. And I'm not sure that there's a difference between the smell of a big and a small strawberry, unless if they're calling it big strawberry as in big strawberry fragrance. But that gave me a little bit of a giggle, <laughs> so to speak. <laughs> okay, and then the middle notes are quite interesting. We have cacao, orchid, and heliotrope. That's quite an interesting one. I think this is the first time I'm playing with a fragrance that has cacao, orchid, and heliotrope. The base notes are coffee, patchouli, amber, and musk. Several of the perfumes that I've liked have had patchouli, amber, and musk. But instead of having sandalwood as the fourth one, this one has coffee, which should be interesting. So we're going to spray this, uh, first of all, on paper can't try it on today because I already put some fragrance on this morning and this sort of arrived a couple of hours ago but I couldn't wait couldn't couldn't wait so oh okay right here we go oh good atomizer that works really well right oh oh not <laughs> okay there we go oh very strong oh ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, hello. Super sweet. Super, super sweet is what I'm getting straight away. Mm -mm. There is some um, coconut. I'm getting the cocoa chocolate vibe from it. I think orchid is a really difficult fragrance personally based on my experience with orchid flowers. I can't say that I'm picking out the ginger. Maybe ginger is something that comes out over time. 
plum. No, I'm not picking out the plum. Mm. I am getting the edge that you get from coffee, though. It's just like a tiny, slight edge there. Loving it so far. So it's like a sweet, but not saccharine sweet. I don't think it, this doesn't smell to me like it's a cake soaked in syrup. But maybe like um, a spicy fruit cake, actually. That's the vibe that I'm getting from this. But I like it. I like it. I like it very much. I... <sighs> Do you know what? I'm going to wear this tomorrow. This is the fragrance that I'm going to wear tomorrow because I have tried um, the other Rub Fleur fragrances from Rihanna and I loved Rub Fleur. Nude, I was okay with and I quite enjoyed Love Always. But Rub Fleur, I ordered a big bottle, which I should be getting sometime soon. But this is a, you know, cacao. The cacao is really coming through. If I have to be perfectly honest with you, I'm not getting any strawberry. But it's very possible that the strawberry in perfumes doesn't actually smell like real actual strawberries. Kind of like how they sell ice cream and they say it's strawberry flavored ice cream. But the strawberry flavor isn't like real organic strawberries, you know. So <laughs> maybe I'm beginning to think that that's the case. But oh, this is beautiful. Oh, I love it. I love it. Thank you so much, 50 Cents UK, for recommending this. I like what I'm smelling on paper, and I'm pretty sure that this is going to be great on my skin. I will be back to report how this does on me in terms of longevity and all of that. But yeah, if you haven't checked out 50 Cents UK, then please do go check her out. I'll put her link in the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more perfume madness here with me. <laughs> Bye.